Hi, my name is Roy, and I'm here at Juanito's Liquor Store bringing you another review of Jägermeister Cold Brew. It's a new uh, alliteration that they brought out, and it's uh, another coffee, but uh, bringing another, a totally different take with the Jägermeister behind it. Uh, Jägermeister um, having 56 different herbs and spices, um, and so will the cold brew. Uh, they numb down the, the proof a little bit, just so you can, it can have more of a coffee feel to it. And, and uh, you can see all these herbs and spices that that you that we could sample. Like, man, you can smell it right now. You can smell all the all the spice in the air. I do have a an expert bee today, and she'll be guiding us through the the cold brew experience. Uh, she is uh, rep representing a selected models, and it's been brought here by no way. Is this review uh, influenced by selected models? This is completely, totally, completely candid, and. Uh, and we're just gonna take a natural take on what this cold brew is all about. Never had it before. Um, and this is what the bottle looks like. It's a pretty good. I like how they did the dark. How uh, it's actually made from arabica beans. Yes, uh huh. That's correct. So this is going to be the new and improved, I guess you can say, new cold brew Jägermeister coffee. So what that is gonna come with, as you said before, that there is 56 botanicals inside. The main ingredients we have are gonna be right here, right in front of us. We have, oh, cacao. Oh my goodness, if only y'all can smell this, but look at that. I can breathe that, oh, it smells so great. I love that. So we have that, of course, we have that ginger. Gives it that nice hint to it. Oh, it's so aromatic. Smells like, oh God, it smells like Starbucks, but way better. I love Starbucks. It, I, oh I, my I, if I can live there for sure. Oh, that smell. Then we have our cinnamon. You can't miss that. Yeah. It smells like winter. <laughs> Tastes like winter. <laughs> can't go on the cinnamon, that's for sure. Right, right. And then we have our cardamom. So this is like a spice. This is something that um, feels like it would go on like chicken wings or something, but it's super good. It has a good, nice, tingy spice to it. And then right here we have the star anise. This right here is literally winter in a bottle. I kid you not. So when you just get that nice smell of it. Mm, so I love that. I just, just bring it in. Right? Look at that. That's as beautiful as the bottle, right? Extremely, extremely. So those are going to be the main ingredients for this. Of course, you do have to mind that there is 56 inside. We also have to, we also have to assume that this is the best, uh, uh, as far as quality control that Jägermeister has provided us. Um, we want to say that w whenever you taste this cold brew here, it's the same thing as you would taste in Germany, as you would taste in, uh, in uh, Sweden, as you would taste in Japan. And that's that's what we want to... Because, uh, uh, you know, it's Jägermeister, so you know the quality is there for sure. Uh, yes. So, And then we have to... And this is a liqueur, so you yes, know, uh -huh. so it's a, it's a, it has a lot of medicinal properties. A lot, a uh, percentage on this bad boy is uh, uh, thirty-three percent, which is sixty-six proof. A whopping thirty-three percent. That's how you know it's going to be a good time. <laughs> and and you'll probably be finding this. Uh, it, it probably just range from uh, twenty-two dollars all the way to thirty dollars, uh, depending on uh, where you're where you're at and what size you're getting. And this is just a limited production, but. Uh, it's something that maybe uh, with more with with more behind it, uh, it's something that they'll start doing all year long, all the time for sure. Um, so let's just pour us a sample. Let's see all what this right. is all about. Oh my goodness. Oh, yeah. oh my god. If you're a coffee lover, this is for you. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I do like how it's a nice little blend. It still tastes the Jaeger. It has a coffee finish. I do like that yes. that nutty feel. That is so good. So in my experience, the thing I tasted the most with this is definitely 
the um, coffee beans. That, that is just absolutely just delicious. And Ripica really has that strong flavor that it brings to this. Absolutely delicious. I'm probably going to buy that one because that is just really I like how silky it tastes. Yes. Yeah, it's it's nice. It's silky. It's uh, thick and, and, and a little bit of hearty. Yes. I do like that finish as well. Um, that's that's pretty good. I, I'm gonna have to rank this a, 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 out of five. A solid four for sure. Oh, that's a, that's a yeah, good one. Yeah, yeah, I that's definitely get. And of course, this is just our opinion here. Um, our opinions is, is subject to scrutiny. You can anybody, you know, you can everybody has a different taste, and that's why they have different flavors. You know, so so you know, that's how we feel. But you know what? This is pretty good. If you're a Jägermeister lover, this is something that you should definitely take a look at. And you know, with coffee stuff and coffee being so big now, I can totally see why this is working out. Why everybody's going to towards coffee drinks and coffee style. And, uh, I mean, crap a mocha, whatever. It's a dangerously good blend. Yeah. <laughs> so if you like these kind of reviews, uh, please uh, like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and so subscribe to us on uh, YouTube. And uh, don't forget to leave a comment down below and have a beautiful rest of your day. Thank you guys. Don't miss out.